Hey group three, good morning, good afternoon. I don't know what time you're watching this. It's morning for me, it's a beautiful day. Um, so I hope everything's going well. Here is your rule for the week. So all of your words are going to end in that long E sound, just like last week, remember we had like cookie, I-E, uh, or monkey, E-Y. This time it's Y by itself that makes that long E sound. So the Ys are all at the end of the word. They all come right after a consonant. So there's no E-Y, it's just consonant plus Y says E. And some of your words actually might be a little bit more familiar or easy to you, and that's totally fine. There are tons of words that end in Y that make that E sound. So you should be telling me in the comments, when you write to me, all those things, other words that meet this pattern. Don't just stick with this list. This list is short. If, you, if you're reading, you're talking, and you're like, oh my gosh, that word ends in an E sound. I wonder if it's a Y. Or you're noticing that, tell me, because there's a lot of words that follow this pattern. So here's just a few of them. So let's go over them. Great example would be the word empty. Empty. -E. So again, we hear that long E sound at the end, but it's spelled with the letter Y. And notice there's a consonant right before it, T. Or the word hurry. Notice hurry has two Ys. A lot of times when we have that E sound with a Y, we actually double the consonant, like in happy, carry, worry. It's not a perfect rule, because like here we didn't double the consonant, but sometimes when it's two syllables, um, sometimes we will double the consonant. So we double R's, double P's. Usually double R's are very common. You'll see carry, worry, right? Um, or another example would be dizzy, that also has a double consonant. So we double the Z's. And again, diz E. Do you hear that E at the end? Ooh, that just hurt my throat to say that. Oh, <coughs> gross. Diz E. Like, ooh, I'm dizzy. So all of your words end in Y. All of the Y's say E at the end. I need to drink some water because I just hurt my voice by saying E in that weird voice. Ooh, I'm not cool. But one moment, friends. normal. So here's your list for the week. All of your words end in Y. All of the Ys say E. Your list is hurry, gravy, carry, treaty. You might know of treaties from social studies. It's an agreement between two countries. Usually ends a war. The peace treaty. Guilty, empty, drowsy. Drowsy, look sleeping, drowsy. I'm just kidding. I'm not drowsy at all. Uh, beauty, not really. Berry, that's another double R. Story, not double R. I see, I see why, I see. It's an interesting one. Happy, funny, double. Cherry, cheery, almost the same spelling. One letter changes and now it's a brand new word. Cherry versus cheery. Like, oh, I'm so cheery up today. Cheerful. Dizzy and flimsy. Oh, I like that word flimsy. Not a good thing, but it's a very good spelling, a good word to say. So, find other words that end in Y. Tell them to me. I can think of like 25 right now off the top of my head. I'm sure you guys can think of some too. Work hard. Can't wait to see your work. I miss you all. Bye.